A Central Virginia high school is preparing students for the dangers of the road. 10 News reporter Courtney Lockie shows you the unique way they're pushing two important messages. <laughs> Who says learning can't be fun? <laughs> students at Liberty High School in Bedford are racing to buckle up. No. Many looking forward to hitting the road. I was excited because it's a lot of freedom. But there's another lesson those like sophomore Jaden Clark face when they turn into school each day. I pulled up to school one day, like my first time driving probably, and I saw it there. One that seems to set in a little more. I was very scared, I guess, that that could happen. This totaled red Jeep may look familiar. It's the car a young couple and their three week old were riding in the night they were struck head on by a drunk driver. I took one look at that car that night on the news and I'm like, there's just no way nobody survived that. 122, it's just, just a rough road. It wasn't long before Ben Thurman learned it was one of his former students, Nathan Everson. He reached out to the family to see if they needed anything, but he never imagined this would be their ask to show students what can happen when you drink and drive. Being a teenager, you, you know about stuff and you think it's not going to happen. And just seeing it out there in front of our school with it being a former student here at Liberty High School, I think that really makes a difference. Nathan and Megan couldn't be a part of this story today because finally, after all these months, they're able to get back to work. While they say they hope in sharing their story, they influence at least one person. Liberty High students say it will be many more. In Bedford, Courtney Lockie, 10 News, working for you.